My name is Lulu, I come from Hungary, and I'm a second year PhD student at the Department of History. I first came to China in 2014, I studied Chinese language for 10 months, and after going back, I just couldn't stop thinking about China. I fell in love with the country, so I knew I had to come back. After finishing my bachelor's, I decided to further my studies here, because I think one of the best ways to understand their country and its people is to have direct contact with them. Good morning guys. I usually wake up at 7 every morning and then I drink a cup of hot water. Today is a special day for me because I have a big presentation and a packing opera exam later. So I'll just head off soon. I put a little bit of makeup on, get my stuff together and go to the library. I came to Tsinghua in 2019. The school tries to help us students in every possible way, for example providing financial support, but also there are many facilities that are available for us. So usually when I have a bigger project or I just need a more peaceful environment to prepare for my classes, I come to the library. So I feel like I'm prepared for the presentation, but um, I feel a bit nervous, so see you guys later and wish me luck! I chose modern and contemporary Chinese history because I want to research Hungarian-Chinese relations. I wanted to get a deeper understanding of the particular historical era I'm going to research in order to be able to give a comprehensive overview of my topic. So finally done with the presentation. I think it went pretty well, uh, but I still have a picking opera exam in the afternoon, so I will quickly go to eat. Let's go together. So I came to eat my lunch before my opera report. Tsinghua has many canteens, so you can choose from various cuisines from all over the world, for example, Chinese. So I'll just quickly start eating because I want to practice a little bit before my report. So it was a sudden decision for me joining the Peking Opera Group, but I think it was a good choice because it's a great opportunity increasing my Chinese skills and also understanding the culture better. And here's the room where we usually practice. I think by learning Peking Opera I have a great opportunity in deeper understanding Chinese culture and also the society. Besides practicing with the opera group, whenever I have some time I like to do my own research, finding English articles, watching documentaries and also opera pieces, so I get a better view of this unique piece of art and also I could perform at my best. So that's it for today guys, I hope you enjoyed spending this day with me. I think today was pretty successful and usually after dinner I walk a little bit but today is just so cold so I'll head home right away, take a warm shower, grab a book and go to sleep because tomorrow is a busy day again but that's how we do it at Tsinghua. And I really wish that one day you guys can come and see me perform Peking Opera. See you!